going here, cone on content and all things digital out of home. Take that off and take that off and turn that off and like that. Uh, first chance I got to talk to you since the Digital Signage Federation's board meeting <clears throat> in uh, Toronto. And, of course, we had our mixer the night before the board meeting. The mixer was, it was great. Every part of it. Uh, the sports bar that we had it in was great. The food was great. Uh, the, the, the elbow on the bartender who was pouring, good elbow. And uh, very well attended. I think we had 80 or 85 people there. But, you know, Toronto is a good digital, uh, digital signage city. Uh, next one coming up is going to be in uh, Minneapolis. And uh, Jason is going to put a lower third there with the date and, um, and whatever other information we have for that. Uh, and Minneapolis is a great digital, uh, digital out of home city, too. So I expect to have a good turnout there. I want to give you a heads up and a reminder. The week of October 21st, and it's not that far away, that's the Digital Place-Based Media Week. Uh, and, and, you know, for that, too, um, Daily Do is kind of, Adrian Connerall is kind of like taking the lead there, taking the, the responsibility of keeping all the scheduling and keeping everything in order like that, uh, as well as hosting the, uh, he and, and Steve Nesbitt hosting the, um, the Investors Conference, which last year was just, I think I told you, was just amazing. You know, sometimes you go to these couple of day uh, conferences and, you know, after a while, people are drifting in and out, making phone calls, uh, going to this, going to that. Nobody left the room for two days. There was so much meat in those presentations that you just didn't want to miss that stuff. Everybody there is in the business of the business. Uh, so anyway, uh, Jason's going to put a lower third there with the link to Daily Do's uh, schedule so you can see where and what everything is. Digital uh, Place-Based Advertising Association has their big day. Uh, the Investors Conference is the two-day affair. Uh, NEC has uh, different people, different organizations, different companies have uh, um, the, the social events, including Digital Signage Federation Wednesday night of that week. Uh, we're having a uh, social event. But don't confuse this. This is not a CEO junket. Let me go to New York for a week. There's a lot going on, and you've got to carefully plan this. Bring the people that have the most to gain and that can contribute using what they pick up that week. They can contribute what they come back. Talk about contribute. Uh, last couple of weeks, I've been traveling around with some of the investment bankers in New York and looking at some of the, the different operations going on and what they're looking to do and uh, I'm getting excited about it. I'm getting excited about the money coming into the industry the now real, real, real growth in our industry. We've hit that maturity level where now it's, it's actually making money. But I'm still seeing my, my biggest complaint, which is content, screens airing content that are meaningless. The content seems to be produced to exhibit the technology rather than to convey the message. What is the message? You know, the first part of producing content is really not that hard. Uh, all stories have three parts, beginning, middle, and end. Determine what your story is. What are you trying to convey? What's the information you need to put out there? Who are you communicating it to and for what reason? That's not that hard. You, got, you have to measure your, your dwell time. How long do I have to tell my story? That's science. It's arithmetic. How many stories do I want to tell? How much am I trying to impact that viewer with how many different points? Fit it into that dwell time. Who are you, who are you broadcasting to? Who are you, who are you talking to? Wh who's your audience? Again, it's not that hard. Y you know who you're trying to sell and what you're trying to sell. Uh, and I'm not, it doesn't matter if you're an ad-supported network, if you're a human resources network at the power plant. You know, maybe your goal is that week reducing uh, injuries by safety, and you're, you're using digital signage to convey that information. Well, it's the same thing. You know, what's the dwell time? How long do you have to talk to these people? Where are you talking to them? Who is it you're talking to? That stuff is all arithmetic. 
The creative part, that's where you get into the difficulty. And very frankly, I'm going to tell you right now, you're not all that creative. Everybody watching this is not a creative. I know we all think we're a movie producer. Well, I am a movie producer. But besides that, the, the creative idea, how do I convey this information in the most impactful way? Is it full motion audio video? Is it straight graphics? Is it animation? Uh, and, and how am I doing, how am I explaining it? Am I capturing or engaging is the term we use? Am I engaging and how am I engaging? Am I achieving my goal by telling the story in this way? So there's really, there's two sides to creating your content. There's the arithmetic, the science side. You know, the, the, you should be able to sit around the desk and decide. Uh, Go out and measure your dwell time, check the environment, make sure that that content that they're going to produce is in context, as they say. You know, I mean, you want to give swimming lessons in a, an automotive parts store. You know, it'd be in context. And then turn it over to the creative people and say, tell this story so I can achieve my numbers. Maybe your ad supported. Maybe it's pure impressions. How many impressions? Well, one question they're all going to ask is they notice the screen. Did they see it? You gotta engage them first. Maybe it's recall. Maybe you're trying to sell at high CPM, so it's recall. Same thing. I'm, I'm not gonna rant anymore about this. I just wanna tell you it's what a waste of money and a waste of time to be seeing these this content that seems to be just there to show how cool the software is or or, or how great the screen is. That's not what we're in our business for. By the way, if you want to make money, you're going to have to, uh, I'll go into another thing. Just do the content right and shut me up for a while. And that's all I got. Um, great DSF board meeting. we got another one coming up in Minneapolis. We'll get you the dates. Don't forget the Digital Place-Based Media Week. You know, that week is, is counter or contra calendar to the Digital Signage Expo. So you've got twice a year that you really have to commit if you're going to stay on top of the business. October in New York and DSA, which is like February, March in Las Vegas. And make sure you're bringing the people that need to be there. Because if some of my friends show up and they want to buy your company or fund it to the next level, they got to know that you got people in there that are, that are trained working and know our industry to buy them. You'll see me next time.